What do you think when you see a serving of salmon or an omega-3 supplement? We commonly utilize omega-3s to support good cholesterol levels and heart health. However, a proper balance of omega-3 fatty acids in the body also supports brain health, lowers inflammation, and causes positive changes in the gut microbiome. Research shows that omega-3 fatty acids increase the diversity of the microbiota. Think about how important crop rotation is to keep a soil healthy. The same applies to our microbiome. It also helps protect the intestinal lining, helps to regulate immune system responses and fighting inflammation in the gut. So which omega-3s should we look for? The most potent ones include EPA, DHA, and ALA. Our bodies cannot make omega-3s, so they must be consumed in food or supplement form. EPA and DHA are mainly found in algae or deep sea fish like salmon, sardines, tuna, and mackerel. We want to eat a serving of these at least twice a week in order to obtain a boost of omega-3 fatty acids. If you don't consume omega-3 rich seafood at least twice a week, consider supplementation. Food sources of the ALA or plant-based form of omega-3 include walnuts, chia, and flax seeds, to name just a few. However, only a small fraction of ALA can be converted to the active form of omega-3s. So if you don't consume seafood, you should consider a supplementation with EPA and DHA. Now let's talk about what to consider with an omega-3 supplement. If you don't consume animal products, choose an algal oil supplement, which will contain EPA and DHA. If you do consume animal products, look for a potent fish oil supplement. When you're choosing a fish oil or algae oil, make sure that every batch of your supplement is third-party tested for heavy metals, dioxins, and PCBs. Considering this information, how can you include more omega-3 fatty acids into your daily life? If you do, keep track of any positive changes you see in your digestive system and health in the months to come.